to this afternoon as 17 year old is recovering after he was shot on his way to school this morning at Kip DC College Prep in Northeast. Right now, police are searching for the suspect and parents of students at the school are searching for answers. Our Randy Bass is live as the frustrations build tonight. Randy, what are people saying there? Yeah, Mark, this shooting here this morning marks the second shooting outside of Kiff DC College Prep just this calendar year. Students I talked to today say violence in and around the school's campus has become the new norm, and parents I talked to are getting fed up with the violent trend and how the school is handling it. And they become numb to it. Like, they literally like, this is another day at Kip. This time, more than a dozen rounds fired at a 17-year-old boy on his way to class this morning. Police say a shooter in a white sedan pulled up, targeted him, and took off. I hope it's not my baby, and I'm praying. I hope it's not no babies. Tonight, parents at Kip DC on edge. Aisha Brown says she felt initial communication from the school didn't stress the severity of what happened. They say that your babies were safe and no need to worry. I go to social media, it's a video with a student on a stretcher inside of the building, shot. The school says it first alerted parents to a student injury off campus before updating parents that it had been a shooting nearby. Students at the school tell us their cell phones are taken during the day, leaving some parents without a way to get directly in touch with their kids. The one point of security that I did have with my son, you strip him of that the minute he comes over that threshold. But then gunshot, knives, all of that can come into the building, but he can't bring his cell phone. And with violent crime on the rise. This is obviously too close to home. This is too close to school. Uh, and we've got to do better as a community. Assistant Chief Andre Wright with D.C. Police is a father of three, and he hopes other parents can be part of the solution. Please uh, talk to your young folks and then reach out to the police department and let us know what's going on so that we can get out in front of this. Yeah, you just heard from Assistant D.C. Police Chief Andre right there. He says it's important that parents stay involved and know what's going on with their kids, especially when it comes to some of these teenage beefs, trying to squash those beefs before they escalate to involve gun violence. The chief also says they're asking anybody with any information at all about that white four-door sedan that allegedly pulled up here at the scene and shot at that teenager today or any of the suspects or anything about this incident at all. Anybody with any information is asked to get in touch with detectives tonight. Live in Northeast, I'm Randy Bass, DC News Now.